welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey girl hey if not new here hey girl hey it's Willie. so um this is going to be the start of a new vlog i'm currently editing currently editing a video from last week right yeah I'm editing a video from last week, um, which was October. Y'all, yeah, um, this is the first of November that just passed. It is currently Saturday, November 6th. It is 10.06 in the morning. Um, I've been up since about 7 something, so I'm like, you know what? Let me go ahead and record. So I'm gonna edit this video and get it up. Um, so I'm probably gonna be here for the most part today, but I wanna see, I don't know if I have any. So yeah, I need something to eat as well. I don't know what I wanna eat today. Let me just say, I just went, well, everyone in his house just went a whole week pretty much without eating meat or chicken or turkey meat or anything like that the only thing we ate as far as was some salmon and i had some shrimp but other than that we have not had any meat and i'm so proud of us one thing i love is a piece of fried chicken and i have not touched okay so i'm super proud of me and my family we are on a healthier lifestyle journey so can't lie it is hard because a lot of the times like eating unhealthy is the easiest route because it's so much cheaper so much easier to come by so you just want to go and get it but like right now like i could go for some unhealthy food but i'm not gonna do it i'm gonna eat me some caesar salad morning um and i probably i don't know i want to make something to go on top of it i'm thinking about we have some um some turkey meat in there like some ground turkey but i really don't want any ground turkey oh i could go for some tacos today that sound good but yeah anyways we've been doing good i could go for some black bean tacos those be good y'all with no meat just black beans cheese and all of that it'd be really good but um yeah so i am currently like i said i'm editing but i'm gonna take a break i'm using cap cut it's cool um so far i just have to really get used to doing it on a computer if you did not know you can download cap cut and edit on your computer it does not have to be done on an ipad so i'm um, actually tiktok hold up this game. so i'm gonna go to my regular camera because anytime i make tiktoks i always use my regular camera first of all let's <laughs> make sure y'all go follow me on tiktok because when i say i am about to blow up on tiktok that's what i'm going I'm, I'm literally i'm claiming it so first of all this was the video i posted the other day think about doing another tiktok with like that effect or whatever but of me um but so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna make a tiktok and i'm gonna say something about like cap cut using cap cut to edit my youtube videos or something like that so i always go to my regular camera i go over to video of course let me wipe off the camera make sure it's good and clean um i don't know if i'll be able to see this it's saying i want to get this area right here it looks a mess right so I'm gonna be cleaning up all my desk areas i actually have another um tiktok i'm gonna be doing of me cleaning up my desk area but anyways so this is what i want this area right here so i'm gonna press and hold and i like that dark effect so i drag down the little sunlight make it dark and then i press record you hear hey girl hey here hey girl hey this is how it looks so far i don't know if y'all can really see that so this is how it looks before i edit it y'all really can't tell Anyway, I'm actually going to edit. I'm going to edit this. Um, I don't know if I want to use CapCut. If you don't know what CapCut is, that's CapCut right there. If you ever want to know how someone has like certain um, effects and stuff like that on their TikToks, that's how. I don't know. We'll see. So, y'all, I'm just literally, it's all about content creation today. I don't know. But, yeah. So, I'm just going to edit in everything. I'll come back if I make something. Um, maybe like some matcha or something like that. Um, I don't know what I want to do. I'm not really in a mood for matcha. I want some coffee. I want some fries. Which fries, like, I don't mind eating fries. But I'm just not eating. But, yeah. So, I will catch y'all later on. What's up, y'all? So, it's a lot later. Um, I look a mess, girl. I started taking out my hair because I'm ready to take this hair out. But I need to film one more video. So, I left the rest of them in. But, like, girl, let's just... Y'all want to see? Let's just be honest. Okay? All the tracks from underneath the bottom is gone. You hear me? So, um, just something so I can... I'm going to do my looks and I'm going to keep it pushing. I'm going to do a video, um, I want to do two, I want to do two, like, sit-down videos, we're going to see, um, sorry if y'all can hear this, but baby, it's too hot out of the door, um, it's currently four in the afternoon, it is four in the afternoon, okay, so, I'm still sitting here, I'm trying to figure out how I want to edit this video, 
the video is not going up today. It's going to go up tomorrow. Usually I upload on Sundays anyway, so I'm not stressing because I want to keep my schedule. That's why I was like, why would I upload, upload on the Saturday? I'm going to upload Sunday, which is tomorrow. But I did want to get it finished. And basically when I say, <coughs> when I say I want to get it finished and up today, that means like allowing it to go through its process of like, um, allowing it to go through its process of seeing if it's got copyright claims or <coughs> or whatever so y'all my throat has been irritating me i've been coughing i took some night quill last night which helped a little bit but <coughs> might take me a zertex because i really feel like it's my allergies it literally makes me feel like i'm gonna gag it almost looks like something is in my throat irritating it it's like my body just wants to get it out but it's nothing there it's just allergies so, anyways, the video is still not edited, but we're gonna get us something to drink because your girl is thirsty. We went and viewed this, not like actually went inside, but we went and brought past this house that we're thinking about because I'm, I'm gonna give y'all a tea about this apartment in a minute. So, the tea is, um, I would not even go get my plate, I'm gonna fix me some more tacos, but <clears throat> the tea is, it's always yellow in here and it irks me. But the tea is, okay, so basically when we first started looking at these apartments, right, um, our first initial moving date was September 28th or something like that, or 23rd, something, right, <clears throat> which I was just going to push it back to October 1st just because I'm not moving it at the end of the month. That's not smart because if you move it at the end of the month, you're going to have to pay rent on the first. So there's no point in me moving in with less than a week left before the first. So, um, I was going to move in in October. <clears throat> then we get an email in September saying everybody that was supposed to be moving in September has now been pushed back to November. Okay, cool. Fine. So, I looked at the email, you know what I'm saying, and they were saying November 30th. Once again, that's end of the month. I'm not moving in on the 30th, but you got two days before the first and they're going to expect you to pay rent on the first. That's why they're doing that because they want people to move in on the 30th and then pay rent two days later. You got me fucked up. I'm not doing it. So <clears throat> we were going to move in December 10th. The reason I never move in on the first or the last of the month, this is, let me just put y'all on game. If you're new to getting an apartment, never move in on the first and never move in on like that last week of the month. Right. <clears throat> Not unless you just set in stone, like you got your money ready to pay rent the next the next couple days, right? Cool. The reason I'm moving on the first is because when you move in on the first, you're going to be liable to pay the full month's rent, right? Because you're going to be there for 30 plus days, right? So <clears throat> basically, when you move in mid month, like the 10th through the 15th, you are now in a prorated the prorated rent period, right? So they have to knock down the rent. They cannot legally full, like fully charge you for the full month because you have not been there for the full month. So that's why I never move in on the first. <clears throat> so anyways, I hit my, my company, like the apartment company up. I've already paid my deposit, which was $750. Cool. They keep pushing it back and keep pushing it back and keep pushing it back. They keep saying, oh, it's because of these elevators. Mind you, if you ride out there, baby, it's more than just elevators that need to be done. You have buildings that don't have bricks on them yet. You haven't put your, all your appliances in there yet. Your pool still isn't finished. Like, it's a lot of stuff. They just literally pay. Mind you, what makes this bad, these folks have been building since 2020. It is two years later, and y'all are still building. That's ridiculous, right? <clears throat> y'all have all these people money. Y'all made over seven figures because you charged everybody $750 for the deposit. You have now made over seven figures. And the apartments are still not ready. I hit them up and I said, hey, because mind you, they have not said um, we're not going to be moving in in November. This is what they're still saying. We got another email a few we a few days ago that said it's still looking like the end of November. But then when I wrote you separately and I said, hey, can we set my moving date to December 10th? Because that's when I would like to move in. You then proceed to write me back and say, Oh, for my personal opinion, it's looking like it's going to be at least January before they're finished. 
Oh, baby, you ain't gonna say nothing else. Cause at this point, I'm looking for somewhere else to stay. Um, I done found a house, hopefully, you know, fingers crossed that we can get up in there or something because I'm ready to be back in my own spot. I love my mother-in-law, I do, but she needs her own space. We need our own space. I'm 26 years old, babe. It's time for me to be back in my own shit. So the moving process is still happening, y'all, but it's just delayed a little bit until I find another spot. I'm praying on it. I'm hoping that, you know, we can go ahead and get up in there. And yeah, so it's just, it's blowing me. Where's my phone? It's blowing me a little bit because they did all of that just to still not have shit ready. Like what? So <clears throat> it's just, y'all, it's irritating me. But it's an okay house. The house is not luxury. It's not like white cabinets and all. It's got the brown cabinets, which I hate, but I'm just gonna get a little sticky stuff to put over them and cover them up and make them white my damn self. And you have to start from somewhere. That's how I see it. So it is what it is. But it's a three bed, two bath, and it's not that much more than my apartment was gonna be. My apartment was $11.75 a month. This is $11.95. Literally, it's not that big of a difference. But anyways, I'm gonna catch y'all later on. I'm gonna get all this stuff figured out. Um, I'm gonna fix me some to drink and get my shit together because I can't, I cannot. Did y'all so. enjoy the last vlog? Because I put a lot of effort into that last vlog. Yes, it was a little short, shorter than usual, but quality over quantity that's how i see it so to me it was top tier quality it was in 4k had great edits yeah so that was my first time using cap cut i might use it again we'll see i'm not sure just yet if i'm gonna use it again but we'll see um anyways so today is 11 10 2022 it is currently seven what am i saying it is currently 8 46 i'm looking at my work time y'all 7:46 their time so yeah about to get ready to get into work soon i start at 9 p.m what 9 a.m girl can i talk this morning i started at 9 a.m i really wanted some coffee but we'll see the weather is supposed to be really really bad today so i don't know if my power is gonna go i don't know like how it's gonna go today i don't know if it's gonna be scary and i'm like uh -uh, i'm not gonna be in front of this camera so i'm gonna go ahead and message my uh, supervisor let her know or my trainer and let her know like hey you know but yeah so i'm looking on ediblearrangements.com just kind of see what their specials are and um see what i want to get i really want to get something like like with the bear like something like this like you know like a bouquet instead of just regular strawberry i feel like it's more effort to that um it says save ten dollars when you choose pickup so this one right here is 59 this one is 46 no but anyways we are going to get we're probably going to make a nail appointment for saturday because it is time for her to get a feel in her nails it's time for me to get a feel as well can y'all see that i feel like you really can't tell but i can tell like that space in between babe it's time it is time and i'm tired of the color i'm ready for another color i didn't even get to show y'all me getting my nails done in the last vlog like i wanted to it was my first time going so i didn't want to just be out there recording but i'm gonna see if i can record next time okay y'all so i cannot remember when i started the vlog but i just know i have not picked up this camera in a couple of days um it was a really bad storm here <laughs> so it was a really bad storm here so i was not recording but anyways, so I, um, me and babe blew some balloons and I started decorating for her mom's birthday. Um, her birthday was on Monday, right? Was it Monday? Babe? Yeah, it was Monday. I had got confused because mine was on a Tuesday. Hers was on a Monday. And, um, basically it's also Veterans Day today. So happy Veterans Day to all of the veterans out there. But yeah, so we are decorating tomorrow. We have her a, um, massage schedule. So she's going to go to a massage. I'm not talking about, I'm gonna add on the foot thing too. I thought we well, gonna have to pay for that yourself. Cause who? But yeah, so we got her a massage for tomorrow at 1 p.m. after she leave her church meeting. And then I want to cook tomorrow night. I'm gonna make her a steak. Um, should I do a baked steak, baked potato? It's gonna be a loaded baked potato. With some broccoli and some shrimp. Date shrimp, baked potato, and broccoli. They probably just gonna eat the shrimp, potato, and broccoli. No one her, cause they don't really mess with the beef and all that stuff. So she's probably not gonna eat no steak. But baby, I'm eating me a steak. Okay. So we're gonna go get all of that stuff tomorrow morning. Tomorrow's gonna be a really, really busy day. So. 
we're going to be literally running around. So in the morning, we're gonna get up probably maybe like nine, 10 o'clock, leave here no later than like 11.30 because her appointment is at one. She's gonna be going from one to two. She add on a foot thing. She'll probably be there from like one to three. That'll give me enough time to go get the cupcakes. Um, um, I want to do a charcuterie board as well. I kind of built one on the public's website. Find some games or something like that. Get. I want to really get us a matching um, pajamas. Babe, probably gonna be buying some stuff tomorrow. She don't know she's gonna be buying some stuff, but she's gonna be buying some stuff tomorrow. Yes, I'm laying on top of clean clothes. I'm finna fold. But yeah. So what was I finna say? Oh, so yeah. So we're gonna go get the food and stuff in the morning so I can cook. I'm gonna have the food ready for her. Probably grab another um, bottle of wine because. We're pretty much gonna be out by tomorrow. And yeah, I'm excited. This is gonna be a great weekend. Oh, I wanna get us some matching PJs so we can watch some Christmas movies tomorrow night. So probably put on some great Christmas movies, figure out what's her faves and put them on. She really, I don't think she really have a favorite. She just kind of watch anything that come on free. What is it? Free form. So, and Hallmark, so we'll see. What's up, y'all? So, I don't know if y'all can tell, but I finally fixed my camera. I have my settings right now, so I'm good. Um, but it's currently 4, 5, what? 4, 10 p.m. Um, I'm currently finna clean up this kitchen, y'all. I cooked. I'm just gonna let y'all see. I cooked, so all of this has to be cleaned. So, that's what I'm about to do now. I just sprayed the stove down. Finna get to wipe down the stove. Wash some dishes and all of that stuff. Um... Probably gonna play some music while I'm cleaning because why not, right? So I'm playing some music while I'm cleaning. Um, yeah, I got to clean, <gasps> gotta clean this table back off because we're gonna set up her um, her mom's cupcakes here. Babe just went to go pick up some cupcakes and get us something to drink because we don't have anything to drink here other than water and I need something else. So yeah, go sit down, Prince. So go get out of this kitchen bye. That's what I'm doing. Um just trying to get everything together, y'all. Let me show y'all what I got for my job. So they gave us a $70 gift certificate to be able to buy things. So I got me and my baby a water bottle. I didn't spend the whole $70, but got me and my babe a matching water bottle. I don't know if I showed y'all the decor, but I'm finna show y'all. I'm guessing that was what I had to do. But anyway, so y'all got me and babe a matching water bottle. And then I meant to grab both of us a shirt, but I only ended up grabbing her a shirt by accident. But it is a pride shirt from my company, United We Belong. And then on the back, it just says United Healthcare Group, Autumn United Healthcare. So, yep. That is that. So it was just amazing to be able to get some free items, pretty much. I don't have to pay out of pocket. So that's good. Because, you know, a lot of times with companies, they'll get you, they'll make it seem like something is free. Whole time it's taken out of your paycheck. But that literally, like, legit was free. So, um, I reckon... Just this question, why do you feel you gotta lie? You gotta 